right, now we're going to talk about the monkey beaver harness from New Tribe. This is something that uh, Casey at New Tribe in August and a buddy of his, they developed. Um, in my opinion, personally, I think it's one of the best harnesses that Casey's ever created. Um, they all did a really good job. There's some interesting uh, features on this harness that I'm still adjusting to, but um, the one big thing for me is uh, the, the back pad on this is just nice and tall. I got a bad back, so I get really good lumbar support in this. The way that it's contoured and cut, it fits good around the hips. Um, so it is the tallest, biggest back pad for a work positioning harness in our industry. It has the, the leg pads that are similar to the New Tribe Onyx, which, uh, you know, another good harness. I love mine. Um, so it's got the ISC Quick Connect buckles. Um, one additional feature that this has versus what's on the Onyx is if you look on the leg straps here, we've got this additional lower strap. Um, I haven't talked to Casey or August what their thought was in that design, but the one thing that I noticed is it really holds the leg pad, conforms it around your thigh, and it, it, it feels good. I actually like that setup better than the way my leg pads are on my Onyx. Um, and just like the Onyx, you can add in the leg, you know, the, the foam pad, the insert on the Velcro. I use that because I'm not, you know, skinny guy anymore, insulated six pack and all that. Um, the one thing that it had, like all new tribe harnesses, there are slots so we can get our carry tool in there or a transporter, or even a vault if you wanted to go that way. And then, you know, this is kind of a West Coast thing here. There's a ring for your chainsaw lanyard. You got snap there and a snap there for your handsaw. Um, I prefer mine on the left, but again, the webbing slotted, I can make that work. Now, one thing that they did that's, I've never seen this in any other harness. They got ISC work positioning Ds here on the left side. Um, I was a little skeptical at first, but the one thing I will say, even though they're not big, which for me is not a problem, I'm not into hanging 85 pounds of gear on a waist belt harness, is it's real easy to clip stuff on, on and off. Um, you could also, you know, for what we used to do back in the, you know, in the day in the, you know, mid 80s, you could get an ax or a tool in there and have it be wedged too. Um, they've got the little small D's here, two of them on the back, one on each side so you can run a good set of suspenders on there. Uh, Casey at New Tribe does make really good suspenders. You know, my set's in Pennsylvania right now, but when I go to crane school, I'm going to grab them and put them on this harness. We got one gear loop here in the back, so a little bit spartan on the gear loops, but really in all honesty, you can get the equipment you need racked on this harness, all right, no problem. And then they got some artwork there on the bottom for you artistic minded folks of the leg pads. So ISC buckles all the way around, an ISC ring, Rock Exotica rigging plates that are attaching the waist belt and the leg loops, and the rise adjustment on this going you know, from the leg loops up to the waist belt is really easy to adjust and it stays in place. Really happy with that, and it's an essential group colors, so that's a plus for me. So that's the Monkey Beaver. Um, they did a really good job. Super comfortable harness to hang in. Uh, really good all-around work harness. Made by New Tribe, available at Westbird Tree Equipment.